Hello there, I am Giant Quarters and we're Pokemon Leaf Green Redo. In the last part, we took on Route um, 14, I believe. We finished that up. Um, now we're back in Saffron City and we're going to take on the Fighting Dojo. And probably a little bit of self -co, um, self co building when we get done with this. So just avoid one battle right after another. Like, if you go back around the middle, the next battle will start. One person, one of them will see you, and then the right, the left one will see you, I guess. And then the person on the right will see you after that battle, right after. And you won't even get a chance to move, so I'm gonna just do this. Where you can just focus on one person. When I first played this game, I thought these were all double battles, but they're not. Oh well. I hear you, good. Show me. Okay, so I have a bender up front. Black belt, hide key, uh, yeah, I guess, high key, hide key. Okay, let's use um, wing attack on this thing. It's a machop level 32. It should be in my choke, but oh well. Easy enough for me. Makes my job easier, I guess. Okay, here's a machoke, okay. We'll go for the air waste then. See how much this does. It'll be super effective, I know that. Oh, I almost want to kill it. Nice. Seismic Toss, it's going to do 32 HP on Airbender. Because again, Seismic Toss does the same amount of damage. Same HP amount of damage as its level. So for example, that Machoke was, um, that Machoke was level 32. So it did 32 HP on Airbender there. Let's do the Wing Attack to finish it off. Yeah, there we go. Ready Feed, Black Boat, Heike. Okay, cool. Judge, one point. Okay, thanks for $7.68, man. Let's see, let's take on this guy next. The, the one on the right, yeah. How oh, uh, you're trespassing in our fighting dojo. Sorry, I kind of want to hit Monchan or hit Mon Lee, obviously. <laughs> Back about Hidoshi. Hidoshi, I don't know. Isn't that my chap? Okay, this one's level 31, okay. Cool. Let's go for the wing attack on this one. It should one hit KO it. And it does, awesome. So that goes Machop. Minky, okay. He was, like, I think his last Pokemon might be a Primeape, actually. If I were to guess. So the Wing Attack hits, okay, good. And it takes out the Minky. Cool. Primeape, ooh, that was right nice. Primeape is one of the fastest fighting types of Pokemon in the game, so. Yeah, but luckily I have Ender outspeeds it, so that's good. There we go, nice. Wanna KO for the Wing Attack. Yeah, and Airbender's now level 37, awesome. We defeated Black Belt Hotoshi. Okay, oof, I give up. Thanks for the $7.44, man. Okay, so let's go to um, my mean next. Let's take on this guy. On the left. Uh, take your shoes off. Never, I will not take my shoes off. I don't take off my running shoes ever since I put them on. What an RPG joke, how like you never like change clothes or anything in RPGs really. Well I guess like equipment and stuff I guess that's you know exception but you know. Let's go for the side beam on this Mankey. There we go. It should want to kill it because I'm feeling pretty confident. Yes it does, awesome. Cool. Okay yeah. I like Mankey, okay. Hey this guy's three Pokemon. So two Mankeys and then... I'm guessing for, I'm a uh, maybe a Primeape actually. Two Minkies and a Primeape is my guess. The save even takes that Minky out. Yeah, awesome. Okay, and the Primeape. Yeah, I was like, cool. For this Primeape, I'm going to use a Psychic on it. So, level 31. Let's use Psychic on it. it um, my me not speeds the Primeape. That's cool. There we go. And the Primeape is down. Wave feed Black Belt Mike. Okay, cool. I give up. Thanks for seven dollars and forty-four cents. You guys give out the same like amount of money when prize money, when you guys lose to me. Ha ha ha. Hi yeah. I have no fear for anything tough. I shatter boulders from training every day. For training, for training every day. Okay, that's cool. This is a black belt Aaron. He's, okay, has one Pokemon. It's Primeape level thirty-six. Ooh, okay. It's cool. Let's go for the Psychic. Let's see what it just does. I don't think it'll want to kill it, but we'll see. Of course I want to kill it, cool. I was doubting myself there. And then, yeah, cool. My means uh, now level 37, so that's pretty cool. We defeated Bakbot Aaron. 
You stub, you st ouch, stubbed fingers. Okay, thanks for the dollars and sixty-four cents, man. Now all that's left is the um, master guy, so I'll take him. I'll put everyone back to the front, though. And let's talk to him. Well, actually, if you go actually to one of the Pokemon Hitmonchan or Hitmonlee, he'll say grunt. He'll see you, be all shocked, and say grunt. I am the Karate Master. I am the leader here. You wish to challenge me? You wish to challenge us? Expect no mercy. Fwa. I beat all your students, per se. Like, just like in, span in the span of like five minutes or less. So, yeah. He starts off with this one Lee. It's level 37. Okay, cool. Let's go with the wing attack then. Um, yeah, one of cares. Cool. Nice. And then Hitmonchan. Let's switch to, um, my mean for this. Just so, like, you know, everybody can take out the Hitmonchan or Hitmon Lee, and then my can take out the Hitmonchan. And Hitmon Chan is off. I think it's it's, it's clearly a reference to Jackie Chan, and then Hitmon Lee's a reference to um, Bruce Lee. They're both fighters in karate and martial arts and all that. So that's pretty cool. Let's go for the psychic. Oh, I didn't faint the Hitmon Chan one hit. Dang it! Thunder Punch. Okay. Okay. Cool. Let's go for the Shock Wave. Let's have our own little electric electric party here, I guess. And there we go, the Hitmonchan goes down. So there we go. We defeated Black Belt, uh, Kochi. Kochi. I'm probably mispronouncing his name. I butchered it, probably. Ha! Oh, Arg, beaten! Thanks for dollars and 88 cents, man. Okay, so let's talk to him again. Indeed, I have lost, but I beside, beseech you, uh, do not take our emblem as your trophy. In return, I will give you a prized fighting Pokemon. Choose whichever one you like. Whichever one you like. You don't get both of them. You get one of them. So here's on the left side, you get him on Lee. You want the high hard kicking him on Lee. Um, I think either in my, I think either in Pokemon Leaf Green, my original walk the guide, or my Pokemon Fire Red, let's live stream series, I picked him on Lee. But I'm gonna pick him on Chan this time. So yeah, I'm gonna say no. And on the right, there's him on Chan. I kinda prefer, um, him on Lee over him on Chan. Uh, when I first played this game, when I first like played Yellow, I'd always pick Hitmonchan because I thought like how I could use like Thunder Punch, and I don't know if I could actually use Thunder Punch back in the the first gen games, but I'm not sure. But, like I like how it had boxing gloves and stuff. I don't know. I'm gonna pick Hitmonchan this time around. I'm not gonna be using my team or anything. I just use it for my Pokedex, I guess. I give him give him name to Hitmonchan, of course. Let's give let's name him. I don't know if Jackie Chan will fit because like I remember uh, if I did choose. Uh, him on Lee, I neither uh, those two past projects of mine, Pokemon Leaf Green and what's live stream Pokemon Fire Red. I did I think I nicknamed it Bruce Lee and it fit. But I don't think Jackie Chan fits. Unless I can put no spaces. Unless Jackie uh, Jackie Chan fits without spaces, I guess. Jackie Chan. <laughs> I'll just say it very fast. Jackie Chan. Jackie Chan. Cool. Let's just go with that. I'm hoping I'm spelling that right. It looks like I am. Jackie Chan. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that. Okay, Hitmonchan was, uh, it says, it's, it's embarrassed if it's nickname, so it just says Hitmonchan. Hitmonchan was transferred to the Bill's PC. It was placed in box, box one. Okay. So we can actually enter, exit the fighting duo now, fighting dojo now. We're only at nine minutes in real time in the recording, in recording time, I should say. It's less than nine minutes, obviously, in the actual video, because editing at the beginning when I had to sync this video and stuff, like I do every part, when I do live commentary and stuff like that. Um, let's see, do I have to put anything in the storage system, by the way? Um, no, I don't actually. I'm gonna heal up real quick, so I'll meet you guys back on the other side. Okay, so, we already got the TM29 Psychic from Mr. Psychic right here. Here's his house again, by the way. Mr. Psychic's house, cool. And we taught that to, um, Mamian, actually. This guy's still taking a snooze, right? Snore. Ha, this guy's taking a snooze. Again, closest to our own dialogue for a character at all in this game for like the first time. Except for maybe other times, but I don't think there's really any other time like you, you'd think the character you're playing as speaks, you know? It's all about the rivals talking, and the Pokemon champs talking, and all the trainers talking that want to fight you. Yeah, okay, let's put, um, let's put Trollcuff up to the front. No, I didn't, I didn't even put Giant Green up to the front, my bad. Sorry, I didn't press it down enough too many times. Okay, so I'm gonna switch Tropicoff with Airbender, so Tropicoff's up at the front, and then Mimean can switch with the Firefox, because you know Airbender and Mimean are level 37, 
and my four other Pokemon, Giant Green, Starman, Firefox, and Treble Clef, are all level 36 still. So let's take on the Sylphco building. This is Sylphco. I think we can run in here. Yeah, we can. Okay, cool. It's like a big giant fountain in the middle. Um, but no, no one's here at the front desk. That's odd. It's like Team Rocket's here or something. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go four by four, so I'm gonna use the steps first, because I wanna battle like every trainer in here I can. Because like I love having, you know, experience and stuff. Just battling for the experience and getting prize money, of course, to buy more items and stuff and whatnot. Let's see, I'm at um, a little over five hundred thousand in my money right now. Let's take on uh, this rocket gun here. Hey kid, what are you doing wandering around here for? To stop you guys? I knew you guys were in Saffron, so I was just gonna be like, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna spoil Team Rocket's plans again. Yay! That's what I do for a living, really. <laughs> At least in this game, that's my objective to do that, is to mess with you guys and stop your plans. Let's go for the Thunderbolt and the Skull Bats. I'm on level 25, so Triple Cuff is 11 levels higher than this thing, so it's a good chance to smite one hit kill. And I'm right, cool. There goes the Gold Bat. Okay, cool. Okay, a Zubat, okay, I'll stay in. A Zubat level 25, okay, nice. Let's go for the strength. Let's see if we can faint it with one strength. I don't think we can, oh no, one AKO, nice, cool. Again, I'm doubting myself, you know, because I don't want to be overconfident, you know. Another Zubat, okay. He has five Pokemon, so he has three more left, including this Zubat here that's level 25, just like the last one. And this one's also male like the last one, too. And it goes down like the last one with one strength. Haha. <laughs> Another Zubat. Okay, you have three Zubats, a Golbat, and I don't know any final Pokemon is yet. It might be a Golbat, hopefully, because you have three Zubats on your team for crying out loud. They're all the same level, all the same gender, taken down by the same move for the same amount of times it's being used, which is once. Okay, Radgate, cool. So, let's go with the strength, I guess. Let's see how much it does. And, oh, cool. One of kills like that, too. Wow. Trubacuff is on a roll. We defeated the Team Rocket Grunt. I goofed. Thanks for eight dollars, man. Really appreciate it. Okay, so and then here's another Team Rocket Grunt right here. No kids are allowed in here. Oh, that's not very nice. Okay, Team Rocket Grunt would like the battle. Okay, it's a Cubone. Okay. Cubone, Cubone, level twenty-nine. Let's go for the strength on this thing. Again, you know, Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt will not affect Cubone because it's ground type. So, and ground, uh, it does, ultra type moves don't affect, um, Cubones or, or any ground type, type in this game at all. So, keep that in mind. But I'm pretty sure you may have already known that. I don't think this is all you guys' first rodeo. There we go, Triple Cuff Goo to level 37 with that, awesome. I have to defeat that Cubone Zubat. Um, we'll switch to, um, switch to Star Man. There we go, nice. Let's go for the surf, I guess. Let's try to make that Zubat super wet. Let's surf. Okay, that Zubat fainted. Nice. Okay, it's, yeah. Got some experience for Starman right there. And we feed the Market Grunt. Tough. Thanks for the $9.28, man. Really appreciate it. So, let's see here. Um, let's switch to Starman for this. Um, so, Starman can get to level 37 next, I guess. Yeah. Um, let's see, let's see, this is a lock, these two are locked doors, um, it says, nope, a, it needs a card key, which we'll get later, and then, nope, it needs a card key, so those little doors are locked for the time being, because we don't have the card key yet, but we'll get the card key eventually, I think it's around the fifth floor of the Silco, but I'm taking it one floor at a time, just to get all the trainers, and to get all the experience I can, really, it's off limits here, go home, no, I gotta stop Team Rocket, you don't understand, scientist, what's your name, scientist Jerry, you wouldn't know, cause you're. Are you, are you? Is your? Oh, never mind. I was gonna make a Tom and Jerry joke there, but then like it wouldn't really make sense. So like I stopped before it got too embarrassing for me. Yeah. Okay. Let's go for the surf attack. It's gonna be neutrally effective, I think. Or it won't. It, I won't say it's not very effective, even though it's in against the electric type Pokemon. That's okay. I think. I think water is you know neutrally effective against electric anyway. Full torp. Okay. Yeah. We'll we'll prove this here, cause I know. Voltorb is a pure electric type Pokemon in this game, so this should be uh, neutrally effective. So it won't say it's not very effective, it'll just do regular damage. You know, say it won't say super effective, it won't say not very effective. It's gonna be neutral. And then he has a Magneton, okay, so I mean, he has another Surf. 
This one's level 28, cool. It's just like three magnets, right? <laughs> Except for they have different color magnets. <laughs> there you go, one KO for all three of those Pokemon. Nice. We defeated Scientist Jerry. You're good, thanks. Thanks for $13.44, man. And these teleporters can teleport you to different f fours, but I'm not going to mess with them right now. See, I'm on a, uh, that was the eighth of the four right there. But I want to take it four by four, as I said before. That rhymed. I think I got all the rocket and scientist trainers, yeah, on this floor. So that's good. We can go up the next floor. Yeah, this is just another teleporter. Okay. And you can obviously just take the elevator and go to different floors that way, too. You don't, I think you already have the lift key or something. If it needs a lift key, you already have it from the rocket hideout. Still in your key items pocket. So yeah, I guess so here's the third floor of this, let's go. No, no, okay, there's a rocket gun right here. Team Rocket Gun. Quit messing with us, kid. Never. It's my job too, I'm sorry. Okay, yeah. Look, he says I'm Red Kid level 28. Okay, cool. Let's go for the, um, Thunderbolt on this thing. It's gonna go for Quick Attack to get the first attack. Is that a critical hit? Okay. You wanna play like that, Radicate? We'll play like that. We'll play Hardball. We're, we're gonna play Hardball. And without, the, I'm gonna finish with the Water Pulse, actually, yeah. There you go, Radicate. You're fainted now. Ha ha ha, sucker. Okay, so with that, Starman grew to level 36. Or 37, I mean. 37, there we go. No, okay, we'll switch to, um. I guess we can switch to Firefox for this one. Nice. No, okay. Um, let's go for the flamethrower on this thing. It's level 28. Hopefully it can do at least over half of its max HP. You know, you never know. Okay, over half. Cool, and it burned it. Nice. Confusion, okay. Firefox, please take this like a champ. There we go. Awesome. So it's hurt by the burn. Let's go finish it with a quick attack on it. So let's see if quick attack finishes it off. And it does. Awesome. Cool. And then eradicate again. Okay, another eradicate. So, let's go for the flamethrower. Okay, this red kid's gonna be a jerk and use quick attack just so it gets a guaranteed attack on, or guaranteed a hit on a uh, Firefox before it faints. There we go, yeah. That's exactly what it did. That's exactly what it did. We defeat Team Rocket Grunt. I give up. Thanks for cents, man. I'm glad you give up because you guys are bad guys, obviously. You guys are bad. You're the antagonist of this game. Let's switch, um, Starman and, uh, Firefox, and let's switch gi Giant Green with, uh, Starman. So, yeah. Again, uh, we need a card key to open this door, even though it's a different kind of, like, lock, you know? Um, let's talk to this person. I work for South Dakota. What am I to do? I just sit back and relax. I got this. Okay, there's a teleport over there. Okay, that's about it. Okay, and there should be a, tr uh, Okay, I thought there was going to be a rocket gun there, but maybe it's on a different floor. Did I get everyone on this floor then? This is another teleporter. I think I did, so let's move on to the fourth floor. Cool. Okay, we're on the fourth floor. There's a rocket gun. Intruder spotted. Okay, let's battle, man. Let's take you on. I, I can take you on. You, you're going to lose Team Rocket Grunt, who doesn't even have a name. Your name is Team Rocket Grunt, basically. That's what you're labeled as. Just like in Star Wars, how you ju they're just labeled clone or stormtroopers. They're not really given a name, except for in, you know, except for in Episode 7, um, The Force Awakens, where Finn gets named by that one pilot. Uh, I forget the pilot's name, honestly. I'll probably put a text over if I can find his name, I'll have to Google it, because I don't remember right now. Uh, let's see here, let's go for the dig and see what she does, I guess. It's going to be super effective, at least. But I'm not sure if this is going to want to kill it, so maybe this... I'm just testing the waters right here, so I don't know. Let's see, it want to kill it, awesome, cool. There goes that gun's nice. Okay, a Q-Bone, okay. It's a ground type, so... Q-Bone, gra ground, ground is super effective against fire. But I can just use flamethrower on this thing. Uh, hopefully at least do over half, I'm hoping. Let's see, it does, a f <laughs> knocks it on one hit, awesome. So there goes the Cubone, and he has a Zubat, okay, cool. Let's go for the, let's try Ember, Ember, jeez, I don't think I want to use the whole flamethrower on it. Yeah, okay, there we go, I can just Ember and the Quick Attack. I'll use Wing Attack to do some damage on Firefox, but Quick Attack should take it out, and it does, awesome. Cool. Firefox good, level 37, nice. I defeated Team Rocket Grunt. 
who doesn't have a name still. Who are you? I'm Steven from Pallet Town. Thanks for the $8.96, man. Let's get this item real quick. It's a um, TM41 Torment. It's not a TM I want to teach any of my Pokemon, honestly. What does it exactly do? And it's a, is it somewhat close to, somewhere to taunt where it has to do with like making your opponent attack or use certain moves? Let's look at it real quick. Um, Torment. It's a dark type move. It it enrages the foe, making it incapable of using the same move successfully. Interesting. Okay, makes sense. It's tormenting, so makes sense. Let's switch. Um, Firefox and Giant Green. So I got everyone down there, right? I forgot. I just there we go. Okay, I got everyone down there. And then over here, we got some more trainers. Here's another Rocket Grunt. Yeah. Team Rocket has taken over the self co. Yeah, I can see that. But I'm here to stop you guys because you guys are evil. Okay, here's my shop. Okay. Cool. Choose Razor Leaf on this thing. Nice, okay. Okay, it's a drowsy next. Okay, so that's not so bad. It's only level 29. Okay, let's use Razor Leaf again. And it hits. Awesome. I love when Razor Leaf hits. It did a little bit over half, so that's good. So one more Razor Leaf should take this thing out to dinner. I mean, take it out as in faint it. <laughs> okay. So here's a drowsy. Yeah, okay, it's still a drowsy, of course. So now it's like it didn't change or anything. It didn't mega evolve. That's not the way to in the like Pokemon games. Arg. Okay, here is. Thanks for the 90. Not, thanks for the $9.20. There we go. 90. Thanks for the $90. Okay, here's another gate which we can't unlock yet. Without the card key. And then here's another gate we can't unlock without the card key. I think that's it for this floor. Let's go to this floor next. The next floor, which is the fifth floor. And this is the floor we get the card key in, actually. So. I'll keep trying in front. I think this guy is either a Weezing or a Hypno. I'm hoping he has a Hypno because Weezing, I, I, I'd have to switch up because the only effective move <laughs> Giant Green has against the Weezing is Tackle, but it takes a while. Because Tackle only has 35 base power. Okay, show Team Rocket a little respect. Okay, this might be the last part of the video too. So, yeah, this is Team Rocket Grunt. He doesn't have a name, just like the other ones. Okay, good, he has a Hypno. Good. Even, oh, this thing might know uh, Confusion or Psybeam or something. I don't know if it knows Psychic or not, but... Oh well, let's use um, Razor Leaf on this thing, it hits. Let's hope we get critical hit. It's only level 33, so that's good. Oh, that was a critical hit, nice. Here's the headbutt. Let's use another Razor Leaf then. Yeah, this is looking good for us. There we go, the Hypno goes down. Cool, we defeated Team Rocket Grunt. Yay, cough cough. <laughs> you said you have a Squag Toad or something. <laughs> Thanks for the $10 and 56 cents, man. Okay, so yeah, this has been none of my Pokemon Leaf Green redo walk the guy part. Next part will take on more of the self co. I think in the self co might take three parts. This part, next part, and probably next part, another part after that to finish. I could be wrong though. But yeah, it's looking like that might be how it goes, I guess, because I want to cover everything in here really. So yeah, so this has been Janko again. I would like to thank for watching again. Goodbye, and I'll see you guys next part of my Pokemon Leaf Green redo walk the guide.